Gob David Amuhab has been leading the Heng Om San traditional authority following his recognition in 2004. However, since last year, his health began to worsen, compelling him to take a decision to step down. Here is a head as a symbol of my blessings. I will also give you a walking cane. Alfred Amuhap marks the second gap of the Heng Om San traditional authority. I am very proud for my father to handle me the, the things and also my peoples did not and I will say to the Lord so that they can stand for me. What? The chairperson of the Kunene Regional Council, Hendrik Gaubaib, says it is very rare for a chief to hand over his chieftaincy while still alive. The chief of the Kauko died and disputes are still continuing on who should succeed him. The cars of the traditional authority are parked at the governor's office, yet people do not want to see beyond that and appoint a chief for themselves. Gaubaib commended Gaub Amuhab for his brave and thoughtful decision not to lead until his last day. Ocho constituency councillor John Sancino called on all to embrace their culture. Continue, market your culture, and make sure that you have materials available for future generation to come and witness, to come and see how things have been done, and also to educate them and be the one again to, to occupy your current uh, uh, space for them to narrate to their, to their generations to come. The Umsan women also launched and showcased their traditional dresses at the festival. Evelyn Paulus, NBC News, Serenkop Farm, in the Ocho constituency.